add a circle, scale it down, extrude it up, scale it up, extrude and scale it up, extrude it up, extrude and scale it down, extrude it down, extrude and scale it down, extrude and merge it at center, extrude, scale it down, extrude and merge it at center, add a subdivision modifier, add loop cuts to make the edges sharp. Change the shade to smooth. In the preferences, turn on the import images as plain add on. Import the plant texture. Rotate it 90 degrees on the x axis. Go to the shader editor and add a simple PBR texture setup. Add an image texture and open the translucency texture. Add a translucent BSDF and mix it with an add shader. Add a transparent BSDF, mix it with a mix shader and in factor, plug in the alpha map. Go to edit mode, turn on the correct face attributes option, add loop cuts around the leaves and the branches. Turn off the correct face attributes when needed. Select the edges and then rip them off by pressing V. And do the same for all of these. Select all the vertices and separate them by loose parts. Select the bottom vertices, press Shift S cursor to select it and then set the origin to 3D cursor. Select the plants, rotate them and position around. Go to Edit Mode, turn on Proportional Editing and make some variations. Select all the leaves and branches and then hit Ctrl J to join. Place it in the pot and scale it up. Duplicate and rotate it. You can use proportional editing to make some variations. You can also duplicate and rotate the plant. For the pot, add a new material, mix it with a moss material. In the factor, plug in a noise texture and you can control the intensity by the color ramp. Then add a new ground material and assign it to the top faces. Make some variations of plants and boom.